Over the years, the Civil War monument on the square in the village of LaGrange has become more than just a landmark. I mean, it's, it's, it's on everything, all our literature, it's on all our, our police badges and symbols. And I mean, it's part of LaGrange. If you tell somebody the square, the monument, they know, all know where exactly to go. Even people passing through kind of stop and pull off to the side, take pictures. Erected in 1903 by LaGrange Township at a cost of $3,000, the monument pays tribute to local Union soldiers who died during the Civil War. It has become known as Sherman's Monument after General William Tecumseh Sherman and is the subject of many stories and urban legends. When they first erected it, they had him facing north. And then some people said he should be facing south. You never turn your back on the enemy which was the South at that time, so they turned him facing South. This surveillance video obtained by Fox 8 News shows the moment early Tuesday morning that a tractor trailer drove straight through the traffic circle in LaGrange and toppled the Civil War monument, shattering the statue of the soldier on top. It's just wow, I can't believe it after over 100 years it happened. Luckily it was 3 in the morning and no cars were here on the square because he came right through. I thought, oh man, I hope we can fix this. <laughs> Fortunately, the truck driver was not injured. He told investigators with the State Highway Patrol that he remembers feeling drowsy and then fell asleep at the wheel. The 37-year-old driver will be cited for failure to control. Can the Civil War monument in LaGrange be repaired or replaced? We are told a repair specialist inspected the pile of rubble on Tuesday and gave trustees some bad news. I asked him if they could put it back together. He said, I doubt it. I said, what about a new one? He says, I don't think you could afford it. I think we should put it up to the residents and see what they think. But personally, yes, I think Sherman should be back.